Hold there. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. For the privilege of entering the city, what does it matter? Call it what you want. If you don't pay, then you're not getting in. I think you'd be a little smarter than that. It's been a pleasure doing business with you. Let me open the gate, and you can head into the city. The gate's unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. How can I help you, Brother North? I had another run-in with a thief's guild. Be careful, Lord. The thieves' guild has Maven Blackbriar at her back. One snap. There once was a hero named Ragnar the Red who came riding to White Run from Ulrorix I don't know you. You and Riften looking for trouble? Just don't want you to leave. You're the only good that's the wrong that's answer. Long time. Last thing the Blackbriars need around here is some troublemaker trying to steal a piece of the action. The Blackbriars have Riften in their pocket and the Thieves Guild watching their back, so keep your nose out of their business. Good. Just stay out of the Blackbriars' affairs. You'll live longer. Slip up and I'll gut you like a fish. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? Next time, keep your plans quieter, and nothing would have happened to it. What? Are you telling me you robbed it? Why? Why are you doing this to me? Look, Shadra, last warning. Pay up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. Huh? What do you want? I owe a great deal of money to someone, and I think they cheated me. I don't know what to do. I was able to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and harnesses. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire to pay for the shipment, but it got robbed before it even arrived. Now Sapphire wants her money back, and if I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. You will? Oh! Thank you. Be careful with Sapphire. She mixes with all sorts of nasty people. People of Riften. Yeah. Heed What's your problem? Words. This is one of the signs. I knew that signs stupid that kid Mara would try and find a way to weasel out of his debt. Look. This is really simple. I lent him some gold, he promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. I don't care. A deal's a deal. <laughs> Are you kidding me? I've got the entire Thieves' Guild at my back. What have you got? Don't know why you'd help a stranger like that. But a septum's a septum. Don't care where it comes from. You can tell Shadra his debt's been paid. I'll myself from this den of iniquity. That'll teach me to try and make extra coin around this out. city. Just keep the sermons at the temple and let us all sin in peace. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. Ah, well. I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest breeding horses in Skyrim. He agreed to sell. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. I want you to talk to Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. Good man. You won't regret it. Head to the Riften Jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Riften. You'll be well paid for your time. No idea, but whatever he did, it must have angered Maven. No guard would lock up a Blackbriar without the old lady's permission. I'm not exactly comfortable around guards or jails. Definitely not when associates of mine have been locked up. No, 
I'll meet you outside of town. I'll meet you outside of town. Buying and selling fine jewelry Genuine here. Palmer blood elixir for sale. For thousands of years, these are other people's thoughts. A pair of sparkles in the bottom fall in the sky. Jewelry, legendary Argonian. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. Sure, and I'm Queen Baron Zion. Now tell me another one. Sure, that'll do just fine. Go on ahead. Until next time. Doesn't mean you have to stay in yours, Mr. Dragonfly. Have you come to gawk at me, or is this a social call? Ah, let me guess. He wants his horse. Well, that's going to be a bit of a problem. See, I don't really outright own Frost. That is correct. You see, Frost belongs to the Blackbriar estate. Technically, everything in the estate is owned by my mother, Maven. My plan was to take the horse from our lodge and deliver it to Latrush at the stables. Obviously, that didn't exactly work out as I'd planned. Still, I don't want to cross Latrush. Tell you what, steal the horse and deliver it, and you can have the second half of the payment. Is that Mr. Dragonfly? The outside then I think we're done talking. Place. Well, yes, I suppose it can be. It can be beautiful, too. You should try it. Stay away from that. Come to kill me at the last, have you? Thank the gods. I can bear the guilt no longer. I know I must die. Beware, though. My newfound honor demands I defend myself. I am in no mood for jokes. Strike me down. Take your revenge. You don't remember? Uh, that is my fault also. I am your so-called friend, Inigo. I was the one who killed you. I tried anyway. I am guilty. Kill me. After I shot you, I finally realized my mistake and tried to turn myself in. Your body was gone. The guards did not believe me. They said I was wasting their time. I had to pay them to put me in this cell. It is where I belong. I needed to repent. I need to repent. I heard tales of a remarkable adventurer, both brave and resourceful, matching your description. I knew it was you. It had to be. I knew you would be coming for me, so I waited. Are you going to kill me or not? I see that I must relive it again. Your memory is not what it was. We met on a job. The killing kind. We were hired by a lord called Dupin to kill his brothers. With them gone, Dupin would inherit a great fortune, and promised us much gold in return. Do you remember none of this? Before we left, Dupin told me that if only one of us returned from our mission, that one would get the other's reward also. I was hooked on skooma at the time, and I had a bit of a debt problem. So... 
I tried. That is what matters. It was not an easy choice. We only knew each other for a short time, but I had grown to like and respect you. We got on well, and fought bravely side by side. I threw all that away, for gold and skooma. No, Dupin was murdered by his sister before I made it back to his keep. Our deal died with him. Money is an evil like no other, my friend. It is only just that I die at your hand. No, I am done with this stuff. I want to die with my senses intact. Kill me now. I am ready. I fight with you? Or die defending you? Yes, I accept. I feel lighter in my heart now you have given me this opportunity. It will be like old times. Do not joke about such things, my friend. The sadness I feel for what I have done is brutal enough. For now. <clears throat> Hello there. Just thought I'd introduce myself. I'm Lucian. Hey there, Lucian. My name is Inigo. Very pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you too, Inigo. I think we're going to make a great team. Yes, I am sure we will. You don't sound very convinced. Well, you seem a little, um, little weak. Well-educated? Well-dressed? well feed? Weak. I mean no offense. I am sure you will be fine. Fine? You're sure I'll be fine? Gosh, thanks for the vote of confidence, Inigo. Forget I said anything. Sorry, Julian. It's Lucian. Lucian, yes. Uh, what did I say? Julian? My apologies. Apology accepted. Right then, Indigo. Let's get back to it, shall we? It is Inigo, not Indigo. Exactly. <laughs> Point taken. I do not know about your skill with a blade, but your intellect is clearly sharper than most. Glad to have you with us, um... Uh... Lucian! Lucian, yes, Lucian. Uh, I am sorry. You're doing it on purpose now. <laughs> Mr. Dragonfly, say hello to my friend. Mr. Dragonfly is shy and frightened of almost everything. is a big and often confusing place. We are bound to lose each other from time to time. Never fear, that map you have is special. Let me show you. My brother once found one just like it on the remains of some poor old adventurer in Cyrodiil. It does not only mark locations, it can also show the position of items and people too. Watch this. Where are you, Inigo? There! See? I have placed myself on your map. If we find ourselves separated, all you need to do is look me up. Pretty fantastic, eh? No problem. I am always happy to help. Let us go. I was wondering, can you whistle? Well, it could be a good way for us to quickly communicate. Look, I found this book. It made interesting reading. Maybe you should give it a look over. Anyway, what did you want to talk about? They say that dragons have returned to Skyrim. The Helgen attack does not bode well. I wonder if the Jarl of Whiterun knows he has a giant lizard problem. If not, he may reward us for the information. Yes, information is usually worth something to someone. 
and in this case it could help save lives. Prospect and Peril have always been bedfellows, but these are strange times we live in, my friend. Now, what did you want to discuss? What's next? Where are you from, Indigo? Well, Julian, I grew up in Riverhold, but I spent a lot of my formative years in Cyrodiil. A part of me will always reside there, I think. No way! That's where I'm from! Have you ever been to the Imperial City? No. My brother and I planned to, but we never quite made it. Anyway, I have always wanted to go. Tell me about it, please. Where to begin? People from all walks of life, every race and creed, mingle on broad, clean streets that glow almost white in the sun. New sights and sounds delight and challenge your senses at every turn. Swallows nest high in the pale walls, flitting from the crenellations to swoop and dive and play above saints and sinners alike. And watching over it all, the white gold tower stands sentinel, an unrivaled ode to wisdom and accomplishment. It's... Its beauty is beyond words. Ah, oh, I do miss it. Wow, it sounds amazing. I am sure you will see it again in time. It is quite natural to miss home, but adventuring is a home all of its own. Skyrim is full of wonders, and we must make the most of them while we are here to It was much too short. Send you off in style. Good day to die. 
Well, you're certainly a big old chap, aren't you? I didn't think so. No, I didn't think so. You'll be so much easier to run. The woodlands here remind me of home. Ah, oh, Cyrodiil, I do miss you.
You've done it! Got to admit, I wasn't sure you could pull it off. But you've definitely earned your pay. <laughs> yes, yes, here it is. I think I'd best be off now. It is a pleasant night for a bit of adventuring. Hold up. 
prophecy. Let us defrost here for a while. This is pleasant. Yes, Indigo? Teach me something interesting, please. Hmm, let me think. There's a tribe in Dashan who worship a giant ghost snake, which sometimes tries to kill you and sometimes gives you life advice. Wow. I will enjoy that piece of information for as long as I can persuade it to stay inside my skull. Many thanks. Your words are a tasty meal for the mind. It's my pleasure, Inigo.
This place smells troublesome. It may be a good idea to ready our weapons. Oh, wait. 
I didn't think so. 
enemy dead. short.
meaning to give you this, since this arrangement seems to be working out all right for us so far. Oh, it's a Duema resonance sphere. Just something my father gave to me before I left home for when I found myself someone to travel with. When activated, it resonates with its twin, which I always keep on my pocket. Riften, city of a thousand suspicious smells. Perhaps I'll write a book about it one day. From a distance, that is. Oh, I get it. It's missing, so Grelka must have it. Ugh, I wish this town would stop pointing their fingers at me. There is a thieves' guild in town, you know. something and what might you need working at the rift and fishery is tough but it puts some coin in my pocket thank you here this is for you remain vigilant and don't trust anyone Riften's under my protection you watch yourself now 